Um, firstly, I want to say thanks to Venezuela. It was a very tough match for us today. It was a, a, a good competition for us. Um, I'm obviously very happy that we won. Um, it's been a been a long tournament for us, but it's been I, I feel there's been a lot of growth for our team. Um, and yeah, I, I guess moving forward now, the boys we we don't have our continental qualifier or anything now. We're finished for the season, so our boys head off to their professional contracts, but. It's good to finish with three wins, and I just want to say on a side note, thank you very much to, for Japan for having us again. I've only been here twice on tournaments, and both times it's been amazing, and I love playing here, so thank you. So first of all, let me um, thank Japan and the Japanese people for the hospitality, big hospitality we had uh, in this country. Uh, it was a really amazing uh, time for us. We really enjoy to be here. At the, the end, we also enjoy the World Cup. Uh, if the secret of the life is uh, to be happy f with what you have, I can say I'm very happy with these guys. We are not the, the first team of the world, but we are doing our job. And today, the guys show that uh, this World Cup was useful for us because it teach us something. I mean, we learn, we get some lesson for this World Cup, and the uh, guys improved a lot. And uh, at the end, we finished with three victory in a row. It's something that we couldn't expect after the, the tough beginning we had on on the competition. So we can say now we are happy and we can go to holiday finally. Thanks. And Robbie first told me that uh, he told me during war, during attack warm up, I think you could have uh, my my face would have said a thousand words. So um, I thought I thought he was just having having a lend of me, honestly. Um, but no, it's good. It's it's something different and something maybe worth trying because uh, obviously I'm not a res receiving player, but uh, to have our two best high ball attackers on the court can definitely change change the makeup of a game and can definitely put put the other team out of sync because they won't hit the ball as hard at me trying to target me. So. Um, yeah, it's something, something very good. As I said yesterday, it's very difficult when you have two of your strongest players in the same position. So it's good that we got to try it in this tournament. Uh, you'll have to ask Robbie if it'll happen again, because I don't know. Uh, a question for Coach Roberto Santilli. Uh, Coach, it was rumoured that you promised if Australia won its last three matches that you would shave your head. Uh, are you intending to carry out this promise tonight? A uh, promise is a promise everywhere, in Italy, like in Australia, the other side of the world, and like in Japan. So we make this bet, you know, during the competition and we start so bad and say, okay, if you really win three games in a row, I will shave my head, so I will have a new ball today. <laughs> Uh, you will, you will, uh, you will enjoy to come to the dressing room to see this show, <laughs> special show today, tonight. Thanks.